Follow my lead and we'll get through this. Where the heck are they going? Paris of Ophira. Well, thank you, Gavin, for clearing up the blatantly obvious. What kind of fools are they? Don't they know what happened there? Do they want to get themselves killed? Well, they probably spotted us and wanted to shake us off their tail. No, they're probably just imbeciles. But fret not, Gavin. I I'm not fretting. I know a shortcut. Now there's something I still can't understand. Why you deserted? What's so hard to understand? My sister sent for help because our mother's sick. I figured getting ripped apart by an Arcolite war machine could wait until my mother was saved. <sighs> That's not what I'm asking. You're the one with unclear motives here, Priestess. Why did you send for your brother? You knew there would be risk for both of you if he deserted. I'm sure the Sanctorium would have provided you with at least one bodyguard, so why do it? Keep your cinder-painted nose out of our affairs, Soul Searcher. Why did you two take such unnecessary risks? Because, because it's, it's our, our mother we're talking about! And we're a family. It's not all that complicated, Lady Myrna. For all his flaws, Darian is the only person I can trust with this mission. The world could be on the verge of destruction, and he would still be at my side, until his dying breath. Hey, you don't have to be so melodramatic. I know, it just came out that way. Nevertheless, I can't help but think Alfarius might be disappointed with your decision. My master is used to his favorite pupil behaving rashly. I hope you're right. By the way, Lady Myrna, when we're not in company, I'd rather you called me Celine. All right, but could you stop calling me Lady, then? We have a deal.